that everyone's been led by, by Brenda, who did a fabulous job today uh, in, in pulling together a wonderful tour that's being filled, but also in really spearheading uh, the effort. Uh, so I just uh, do, uh, I know we all feel the same about Brenda, but let's, uh, play, I think Brenda <laughs>
and give people the economic foundation that they need in order to have good jobs and have healthy lives. And so I really admire that uh, you are really the, where the rubber meets the road and having that kind of priority and leadership is, is critical to us. And Massachusetts is, I'm fortunate to be the Commissioner of Public Health in Massachusetts and sometimes embarrassed to go to national meetings where it's like, oh yeah, Massachusetts, and like, I'm doing that already. And, uh, but again, it takes a community to come together. I am a nurse, I'm the first nurse to be the commissioner, which has been a really um, cool experience, and my nurse friends always make me uh, say that when I'm out, but I think we really think about the whole person and how to make them healthy and how to remove the barriers that we have in our communities to health promotion and to, uh, again, do the kind of work you're doing. You're one of our success stories. We really want to get out before a legislator or someone who's going to give us funding. We really need communities like you that continue to do this work and make a difference every day in everybody's life. So congratulations again on all the work that you do. And um, I'm sorry to say that I'll be leaving the department on December the 12th because we are coming to the end of an administration. And I've made the choice to go back to my community and try to do this work at a community level once again. I feel like I've had tremendous experience learning from so many of you and from really thinking about this from the 30,000 foot view and the policy, but I'm a real doer, so sometimes I get frustrated going to meeting after meeting and talking about all the things we should be doing, and I really want to take all the things that I've learned and go back home. Home for me is Cape Cod, where I spent 30 years living on Nantucket and another 15 years owning homes on the Cape, and I'm going to work for Cape Cod Healthcare, for the CEO of Cape Cod Healthcare, who I think is also another visionary leader in um, health, and he really sees that link between community and clinical and uh, a health system, so I'm going to be helping him start a public health program there, originally prioritizing substance abuse and opiates in particular, but knowing the way I know myself, I'm sure I will get um, him engaged in all kinds of other public health things, so um, I'm hopefully I'll be partnering with you as one of your colleagues in the community and sharing our lessons learned so that we can continue to get all of our communities healthy here in Massachusetts. So I thank you for the work we've done together. Uh, sorry that it won't be for a longer time, but as I tell folks back at the department, uh, I'm going to let this new administration come in and see what they're all about and uh, get back to my community and get some more lessons learned and uh, who knows where, where I'll reinvent myself to uh, in a couple of years. So again, thank you and uh, you should be really proud of the work that you do here in the because you really are one of the leaders in public health here in the Commonwealth.